hi there. Uh, this is Janos Fenyősi. I designed and uh, I'm building these uh, oxalic acid vaporizer, vaporizers. Uh, these are for the treatment of uh, uh, against the veromite. Uh, uh, so this is the tool. It uh, it has a strong uh, brass uh, tube outlet. Uh, it uh, it is strong enough to hold the weight of the device. It has a couple of teeth on the bottom as well as on the front, and that catches the landing uh, uh, or the uh, at the entrance. Or when you put it in, it is catching the side of the hive, and that way it is stable and it is not. Uh, you do you do not need to hold while you are using it, but you can leave it there and. Uh, you can put the oxalic acid to the next uh, on the top of the next hive, or, or you can use your time. Uh, so there is the exit tube. It is uh, designed so it is not overheating. It is uh, overheating maximum one or two degrees, which is negligible to the uh, to the previous versions which you have seen on the market. It is a very fast uh, uh, vaporizer. It uh, takes about. Uh, 20 to 30 seconds per hive and you can right away go to the next one uh, this is a, a, a high discharge uh, uh, battery type which means that uh, uh, you can not high discharge but low discharge uh, battery you can discharge it to the uh, low voltage and you can continuously load it and uh, with an 80 amp power uh, battery you can treat up to 300 uh, uh, hives with two grand doses. The switch itself is only switching off the load but it is not switching off the uh, display itself. Uh, here it is a PID controller you can set the desired uh, uh, temperature. Let's go up to now to let's say 230 degrees and uh, here you can see the voltage of the battery and that way you can protect your battery from, from the discharging. A couple of words about the feeder itself, the oxalic acid uh, dispenser. Uh, this is a very unique dispenser because uh, it's able to push out what is there. So if you press it in, it, it is there and you just push out and that goes into the chamber, the heated chamber. And you can set the desired uh, uh, gram quantity just by turning the washer on the end. And here you can see the settings of uh, 1 gram, 2 gram, 3 gram and this is the 4 gram mark. And the washer inside shows the amount of quantity now it is at the 2 gram dose. And that is also set up to 2 grams. So you just press it into the oxalic acid. You put it in and you press it. The second one, if you happen to buy a second one, you can put it into the handle, but usually one is enough. So let's see how it works. Now it is uh, heated up to 230 volts, I mean degrees, and there is no overheating. So I just pull out, I press it into the oxalic acid, put it in, and I press it. And the temperature starts to drop and then right away it starts to go back and uh, by the time it reaches around 220-222 degrees it, is, uh, it has finished the uh, So I just pull it out, press it in again, fills up beautifully, put it in, push down and you can see it goes down about 15 degrees, maximum 20 degrees, and then goes back depending on how much the battery is discharged, a little bit more, and then goes back really, really fast. These are 2 gram doses, and you can see that it takes very little time. I press in, you can press and right away. You see, that there is no depositing on the active tube, it is clean, it is vaporizing perfectly and uh, very, very well it is uh, uh, filling up the hive with these oxalic acid crystals and that deposits everywhere and kills the light.
one more. Pull out. Press in. Put in. That's it. So simple to use. Create a lot of fog and uh, it treats really well with acidity. We tested it on many hives and, uh, and the beekeepers really love it. You can search for it in www.instantwap.eu. There you can see the versions. You can choose the right one for yourself and you can order there. There is a phone number there as well as an email address. You can contact me if you want to be a reseller or uh, if you have any questions and then I can uh, reply to you. You can see how beautifully it is keeping the 230 degrees and there is no overheating. Very well insulated one and uh, the battery is really enough for about 300 hives. We tested it for 240. It was still plenty of uh, uh, load in it, plenty of power. So uh, I calculated about 340. So I I'm pretty safe to say that for 300 hives it's uh, it's good enough. Uh, thank you for your attention and uh, please write or please ask any questions you may have. Bye.